Like uh, playing for the real, open your first game. Oh shit! Um, <laughs> man, bro, that was that was a, a special, special moment for me, man, because it was everything that I wanted and expected from you know the trash talk, the grit, um, the fun, the fans, um, the, the good and the bad plays. Man, I loved it. It, was, it couldn't have been a better day for me. I just feel like, not far as like I feel like I had the best game, but I just feel like I got the full range experience of what it is, what it's like being a player in this league. The pass rush it was effective against Flacco, though. Yeah. Basically, shut down the first half. Uh, a lot of pressure on him. We'll talk about the pass rush. Uh, I mean, I feel like it was just us as a collective group on defense, man. You know, as a as a defensive line, we knew we had to we had to create pressure. Um, our, our DBs did a great job, of, you know, holding up on the back end. So did our linebackers did a great job of uh, getting us lined up. And uh, shout out to the coaches too, man. Coach Buck and, and uh, Coach uh, G Baby did a great job of just um, having that game plan dialed up and we just having to be able to go out there and get some success. Monday Night Football, uh, your debut is at Oakland College. Everything you thought it would be? <laughs> yes, it definitely is for me, man. I'm just happy I got um, got to run out there. Uh, make a couple of tackles, get my first sack, man. That was huge for me. So um, just hoping we can just take this in, learn from the bad, uh, carry it in the next week against Kansas City. You feel like you got the nerves out of the way with that first sack? Hell yeah. <laughs> I, feel, I feel like a big old monkey on my back, dog, for real. Um, not because I feel pressured, but, you know, it was just about, um, you know, as a defensive lineman, you're always just thinking about you know, when you're going to get your first sack, you know what I mean? And especially in this league because they're so hard to come by. And for it to come with my debut, man, it felt amazing and uh, truly a blessing. And hats off to my team because they're the ones put me in that position. So. You also had the tip pass. Oh, yeah, yeah. That was that was just uh, doing my job type stuff, you know what I mean, and reacting to, um, reacting to the quarterback's hands. So. How hard is it to get refocused after Conley goes down? Oh man, that's tough. Anytime your teammate goes down, especially in this game, man, when you know injuries like that where it's a head injury, um, it's a sad moment. But, you know, I wouldn't say it's hard to refocus because when something like that happens, you know, all your focus goes into winning the game for that person. So that was our mindset. You know, let's go out there and dominate and finish the game for them because anytime you go through something like that, um, you don't want it to be for nothing. So that was the best part about it. You went down, uh, Trayvon Mullen comes in. You, you, you have four rookies out there. Yeah. The first, the top four rookies all on the field making major contrib contributions. I mean, was, how do you rally around the fact that they, uh, do you rally around the fact that there's so many rookies out there that are playing such a large role? I mean, yeah, like I said, uh, like I've said before, you know, I feel like the biggest thing we, we talk about is mindset. So we don't see ourselves as rookies first year players and uh, given that you know we may be, be a little bit inexperienced but we practice we went through training camp just like everybody else so we're expected to go out there and perform and uh, Trayvon worked hard um, throughout training camp and in practice man and he was expected to go out, out there and perform well so I mean I feel like none of us were really biting our, biting our, to our, um, our tongue as far as when he was in man so the biggest thing is we trust everybody and if you're out there you're expected to perform so that's the biggest thing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good job. Congratulations.
just, it's just, I'm not promised. Next week's game was like, you know, when I get today, I'm taking advantage. Is anything that you've seen happen for a Absolutely. You know, you can't, you can't even script things like this. That's, that's all, that's all, you know, that's the precision of God in my opinion. I had another, me, on my own, I was messing things up. God was really putting me in this position. And I was just right here. All right, John, I think I gotta ask about the look first. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Call me, uh. <laughs> Look, what? El Salvador. El Salvador. No, call me, call me Woody. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's like you. <laughs> what was the key to the winning tonight? Uh, just going out there, playing as a team. You know, making sure you know we stop those guys on defense. Offense, you know, we want to run the ball, take shots down the field, and that's just you know we accomplish that. But defensively, you know, we got to stop those guys on that last drive, keep my name. How much fun is that? Oh, I ain't gonna lie, I can't describe it. Maybe for me. Just the way you guys were flying around, I mean, is that, is that the identity in terms of this defense? That's the identity we're trying to bring back, yes. Yeah. You know, fast, still getting aggressive. Mm -hmm. Come across the middle, going to get you. So, you know, it's a couple players out there we left right there. And, you know, I, I know I went back for sure. And I know the other guys still playing with us. How hard is it to focus on a play where Rakane got hurt? Um, I mean, you kind of got to just shake it off and keep going, you know. I really didn't see what happened. I think you know he got he fell he was the running back fell on top of him or something, but you know, he was praying for him, you know, we had to go out there and escape for him. What do you think of Derek's performance tonight? I was very I'm very pleased. You know, I mean, in my mind Derek's the best quarterback in the league. Your experience with the First hit was you know, it felt pretty good, you know, to get it out of my system, you know, I kinda had to jitter that first. But other than that it was pretty good. What's your first experience with the Raiders on the crowd during the season? Amazing. I couldn't I couldn't put this picture into my head. And, you know, to go out there and see the fans, you know, them come out on Monday night. You know, and my teammates, you know, just being out there with those guys, it was amazing. Thanks. That's it folks. Wrap right, it up. Right. <laughs> Round them up. Best look out here tonight? Uh, I would say so. <laughs> no, I mean, you know, we're, we're working on something. No, I'm just playing. Uh, yeah, we know we got the win, so it's, it's a big deal. What was the key to the win tonight? Um, you know, I feel like collectively we all played well. Um, I feel like the whole line played well. D-line we played well, but obviously there's room for improvement, so we just got to keep getting better. Offensively, what did you see from your guys? Um, you know, obviously Tyrell Williams stepped up, Darren Waller, and Josh Jacobs. Um, the whole line played great, you know, going against two great pass rushers. Um, so, yeah, it was, it was good to see. Can you explain the feeling of a Monday night crowd, your home opener here against the division rival? It was surreal. Um, you know, obviously I've been, you know, everybody dreams about playing the NFL, so tonight I finally got my first game, and uh, it was it was awesome. When you finally got hurt, how do you guys kind of refocus that um, you know, it's tough, you know, seeing one of your guys go down, but um, obviously he's the next man up, um, and obviously we're praying for him, so hopefully uh, he'll be he'll be back soon. Got some further thoughts on Kansas City? Um, you know, Kansas City is Kansas City. Everyone knows they can, you know, score points and uh, you know, run it up a little bit. So we gotta get prepared. We have a you know a shorter week, so we gotta get back um, and get refocused. So we're excited for that. Okay, appreciate you.